Hello, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of Faster Than Light with the bad enough dudes, Will Delventhal, Mr. Professional. <coughs> Excuse me, that's just the badass coming out. All right, so, uh, yeah, this is episode three. Let's just get to it. I guess we're looking at a store. I don't remember this. Close. Oh, yeah, I remember. This is where we stopped last time. All right, so a little recap. Captain Will over there in the engine room. Um, oh, he's actually pretty good at beating people up. Look at that. And we have Zach up there trying to fly the ship. Eli, the weapons guy. Uh, Weston, just our uh, our local security guard. He kills people if they board the ship. And Joel, our local battery. <laughs> he powers things. He's good. All right, so yeah. All right, so we got some we got some good shit going on. All right, we're trying to save up for shields. That's why we haven't spent all that money. Money, money, money. Got it. Oh yeah, and we have our halberd beam and everything. We're doing all right. So what's happening in the store? Nothing that we want. Let's fix it. We're good on fuel. We're good on everything else. Let's go. Let's just jump. Nah, wrong button. <clears throat> all right. So let's see, we're trying to get down there to the exits. We could go all the way around, honestly. Let's do that. An abandoned space station circles a lonely planet. A quick check yields schematics for a drone. You bring it aboard the ship. Wow, an anti-drone. Mark, mark, mark one. Anti, anti-ship. Anti-ship drone, Mark one. Okay, all right, except we're never gonna use drones, but hey, that'll be useful to sell. Ah, oh, mother fudge, cock. Cock. That means there's a sun. I hate suns. And an asteroid field. Oh, okay, I got it. That's actually not as bad. Asteroids aren't that bad. Oh, except shit, we don't have shields. That sucks. A rookie rock cargo ship has taken its orders too literally and took the most direct route to their destination. Right through an asteroid field. They're confused and fire wildly as you jump in. Alright. <clears throat> Let's these fuckers up. We're not even going to use missiles on these little batches. Um, we're going to first shoot a laser right there, and then halberd beam the crap out of everything. Go. And bye! Oh, our evasion is way up, so asteroids don't even hit us while we're cloaked. Kill them quickly! Ah, uh, what? You suck. Bitch. Ow. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Fuck you. They offer me one fuel, one missile, and 24 scrap. Their system is suffering. The rock ship attempts to make contact. Alien vessel calls you cease your attack. We will pay. Fuck you. We're going to kill you so good. What do we get? Ha ha. We got two extra scrap and one extra missile. Ha <laughs> ha. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap materials. Alright, let's get the shit out of this asteroid field. Something tells me we're not going to be able to make that jump down, and then we're going to have to go back and kill rebels. You arrive and detect signs of battle. A few ships are taking passes at each other near a small station. You don't know if it's a territory issue, a contest, or a rite of passage, but you decide it's best to stay out of it. I would totally jump in there. God damn it, are you kidding me? Wow, this could kill us. This could actually kill us. We might die now. That, wow, we probably will. What the hell? Every one of these jumps now is going to be through rebels. <sighs> that sucks. Don't hurt me. Wait, why do you not have enough power? Oh, you bastard, really? Ugh. All right, we'll fuck up their engines. Charge your shit faster. That thing can't even get through. We're gonna have to wait for the halberd. We'll just turn that off. All right, well they're actually not that good. Ow. Wow, never mind. That beam just screwed my day up. 
Wow. Okay, let's run, please. <laughs> Hurry your shit. That's such cock. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. I might actually die. This might be the end of a bad dude. The rebel fleet has found you, and a nearby scout turns to engage. Well, ball sacks. Um, shields. Not shields, no. Guns. Guns. Oh, sweet, and I can't cloak for four more fucking turns. I'm gonna die. We're gonna die! We're all going to die. Oh, that's a big ass missile. Ew, go fix. Oh, sweet, and now we can't leave until that's fixed. Wow. If this is the end of the bad dude, I'm gonna be really sad. There's nothing I can do. Oh, that was good. Oh, critical, let's leave. <sighs> um, so we'll need to go through at least two more of those. I really don't think we're going to survive this. This might be the end of the bad dude. The rebel fleet has found you, and a nearby scout turns to engage. It's the exact same thing. At least be creative about how I die. Look at how fucked my ship is. Oh, oh, goodness. Um, Joel, go did I die? Oh, where am I? Why am I in the med bay? Go over there. What are you doing? Me. Silly me. Cool, and I can't... I can't cloak now, either. All missiles shoot their weapons. The O2 generator's down. Go fix it, Weston! There's fire everywhere! We're gonna make it crew! Why's my halberd beam off? Oh, because my weapons are damaged. Come on! Shoot that as much as possible! We can do it! Fuck. Well. There goes the bad dude. <laughs> Shit. Well, guys, um, I'll start a new playthrough as a different ship, but uh, I hope you enjoyed the voyage, albeit short, of the bad dude. Kind of a bummer. <laughs> I hope you all have a good one. See you later. Subscribe and shit. Bye.